Hello everyone. Guys, today in this video, we are going to understand VLAN, Virtual Local Area Network. Why we need VLAN? Where we are going to use it in the production network in real time? To understand the VLAN, the need of VLAN, first of all, you have to understand segmentation. So segmentation means what guys? Segmentation means dividing large network into a smaller part of network. Let's suppose you are implementing network in a building in a large building in a big building and you need to connect thousand number of end devices together let's suppose you have lots of computers or computers there servers ip phones iot devices and you need to connect them together so you can use centralized device called switch or access point to connect these devices together so let's suppose you have connected all end devices together with the help of switch like on first floor you have let's suppose 100 computers so you have connected all 100 computer with switch maybe you are using two to three four five six let's suppose you have five switches at first floor and all switches are connected together in the same way at second floor again i have some switches right let's suppose all switches are in a stack that means i have more ports on a single port so if you have two switch with 48 ports so guys total number of ports is 48 plus 48 so if you want to combine these two switch together you can use a stacking you can combine both switch with the help of a stacking now after the stacking you can connect 48 plus 48 devices to a single switch right but you know by default all ports of switch belongs to a single broadcast domain now here is the issue just assume you have connected 100 computers at first floor like this you have thousand number of devices in the large building now guys if any machine will generate a broadcast message whenever any machine will generate broadcast message all thousand number of devices are going to receive this broadcast message right thousand number have machine have to decapsulate it it, it will check what is destination source sorry destination mac address destination ip address and whenever a machine is checking decapsulating the packet checking the addresses that means it is using their cpu so large broadcast domain means high cpu utilization right network performance is going to be low very low if you have placed thousand number of devices in one broadcast domain performance is going to be very low so to increase the performance for the better performance and even for the better security guys see to manage thousand number of computers in a single broadcast domain is going to be complicated but if i will divide it if i will divide thousand number of devices on the basis of department on the basis of floor on the basis of blocks then i can manage it easily so segmentation is very important in the network for better performance for better security for better management for better troubleshooting and you know whenever we perform segmentation whenever we are dividing large network into a smaller part we have only one option that is vlan how we can implement it with the help of vlan virtual area network so hope now requirement of vlan is clear like why we need vlan we need vlan to divide large network into a smaller part for the segmentation and segmentation is required for better security better performance better troubleshooting right so that's why we are using vlan in the real time and most of the network engineer are using it are configuring vlan are troubleshooting vlan so again to troubleshoot vlan you have to learn all about vlan correct but today in this video we are not going to discuss vlan in details but just let me tell you what is vlan so guys vlan stands for virtual local area network which is used to divide broadcast domain so vlan is the tool which is used to divide large broadcast domain into a smaller broadcast domain at layer 2 right we are dividing broadcast domain at layer 2 this time so VLAN means it is also a LAN local area network, but it is virtual.